All right, let's talk about the elephant in the room. No, I'm not talking about high oil consumption. No, I'm not talking about a blown engine or engine knocking. I'm not talking about limp mode or the many lawsuits against Kia Hyundai currently. I'll give you three clues. USB, your precious vehicle, and viral trend. Got it? Welcome back to another video with me and my soul. Today, we're gonna to talk about anti-car theft options to protect your vehicle. Now, I know this is uncharted territory for most, but I'm here to give you some options along with recommendations to prevent your car from being the next victim. What can you do? The anti-car theft market is very versed and there's tons of products out there. Just to name a few, there are wheel locks, there are brake locks, there are remote battery shutoffs, there are GPS tracking, and that's just the tip of the iceberg. Today, I'll be focusing on wheel locks versus brake locks. I'll be giving you pros and cons of both to help you decide. All right, so for the wheel lock pros, it comes with a cylinder type key. It's a visual deterrent. It's good quality. Three mounting points. Universal fit is easy to take off and put back on. And there's two total keys that come with this tool. So here's what it's like if somebody, they get into your car and they start the car up. Now let's say they do get it into drive. They're able to turn the wheel until a certain point. But you see how that moves? I think this can really like break off. So it seems like good quality in terms of what it's made out of, but in terms of mechanics and how it's hooked onto the wheel, I don't think it's the best. Here's what it'll do from up top when you start the car up and move the wheel. And look at the top. So when I remove this, it leaves those really big indentation marks on your steering wheel. So if that's not a problem for you, then, you know, go forth with it. But for me, I left it on. I left the lock on my car for like eight hours overnight, and it took me like a whole day for these things to go away. So. Uh, just something to think about when you are looking for a product for your car. Brake lock pros. This particular brake lock, it comes with the atom cylinder type lock. So that means just when you use the key, it comes with two ridges on the side of the key, which makes it harder to pick the lock. It's hidden from sight, so that can be a pro and a con, depending on your personal preference. It's a good quality material. It locks both the brake and the wheel. It's universal in length, so it fit most vehicles. Uh, it's easy to install and remove. It comes with three keys. It's compact in size when it's not being in use, and it's easy to, to store. You can use it also with a wheel cover. Thank you guys for checking out the video. As you know, there's tons of products out there that you can use for your car. The ones I just showed you are more user-friendly and don't require a lot of technical skill to use. I personally love the brake lock versus the wheel lock. As you can tell, the wheel lock is just kind of all over the place. And I feel it's gonna fall off, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, not what I would recommend personally, but again, all choices are yours. Do whatever you feel is best. 
And yeah, so if you do like this video, please do like, comment, and share. Comment and let me know which one you're leaning more towards. And links will be in the description for both products if you decide you want to give them a try. As always, thank you so much for your time. Until we meet again, peace.